Hi, I'm Peter Kalmstrom of Kalmstrom.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'll show you how to get information from a text file into Excel. Of course, several different ways of doing that. I'm going to just open the text file, go into the edit and select all data or press Ctrl A and then just copy all of the information. Then you place the cursor where you want the data to go. A1 sounds like a perfect place for me. And then I'll just paste. As you see here are the paste options, but even if I just press the paste button, I get these paste options here, where I can select the different options for importing paste operation. I can also use the text import wizard. And here I can determine a lot of things. If the text information is delimited by a special character, in this case, the text file was limited by a tab. We can see if we go into Word, spell Word here, Word 2016. So let's just paste that in there. If you want to analyze them, Word is good at these things by adding this character or this option to display um, the characters. Then you can see that these are limited by tab characters. Excellent, so now we know that, and these are delimited. Fixed width is usually, um, when you're exporting from a mainframe, they usually use fixed width. But this data, data does have headers. It's the first row is the headers of the columns. I just click Next, and as you see, these were delimited by tabs. If they were fixed width, go back here, and then you can set delimiters here. But of course, that's not relevant now. So we're going to use delimited instead, and have tabs. and this looks just right. And then I click Next. And I can select which kind of data should be in each of the cells here. This second one is a date field, so I'm going to import that as a date field. The other ones are text fields, so let's just leave that. I'll finish that, and here we go. Here's all the data imported. You can also do the other way around. If you don't mess with the text file and by opening it, you can just go into data and get from the text like there. And then get the text file like that, and then you are dropped directly into the text import wizard. That works just fine too. So that shows two different ways of adding data into Excel from a text file. Either you copy and paste, or you go into the data and select from text and then you can get the information with via the text import wizard. Thank you for watching this demo.